Thank you for coming back to Polka Dot Mailbox. And if you're new, welcome. Today I am boxing up a Valentine's Day Happy Mail. And I'm just going to show you quickly here how I use my FabFitFun boxes to create a Happy Mail for a friend. So because I um, just want to cover up that FabFitFun there and put a little Happy Valentine's Day, I don't mind if there's snowflake. That's just a quick little way to cover that up. And here I've done a little more decorating to it. So if you've been watching my channel, you'll have seen my crafting. So this looks a little wonky, but it's kind of hard to have straight letters on. <laughs> just a love, a little heart with a kiss. I've put some shred in there and a pretty bow. And this actually is my bookcase that I have created for her. And you can't really tell what it is. And it's really nicely sealed. You can kind of see sort of a peek inside there. You can see the little balls on the feet of the bookcase there. Here I have stitched Tina on a tag for this fun little like takeout container. And I have put a banner inside there. That can go there. Here I have created one of these purses with a fun uh, charm off the end and I've filled it with some handmade flowers and a pamper yourself gift which was all part of what we were supposed to do. We were supposed to send 14 different things. One was a handmade flower, one was a purse and one was a, a spa type pamper yourself um, idea there. Um, this was well the bookcase is a home decor item we could send a tag flip I decided to send a banner we were supposed to send some chocolates and this tells you who it's to Miss Valley is who my pen pal is she's a popular paper crafting youtuber here Paper clip popped off here. There we go. So there's chocolates in there. Inside here is a little flip book that I have made for her. And inside the flip book, I have little envelopes that have um, tea bags inside. I have a video for that. This is how I packaged up my pocket letter. So inside here, you just slip out the pocket letter on the fold. And there's what the pocket letter looks like. And here are all the gifts inside. A rosette, some stars, some candy hearts, lollipops. And I created these cute little word safety pins there for her as well. So that goes together like that. It just slips into this bag here. I'm just going to leave that open so it slides in and out nicely. And then the charm, which is another thing we were supposed to make, our pen pal was a charm, is right there on top. So I have created an embellishment box and this is how I have wrapped up the embellishment box. I've put some cute little puffy stickers and the word cute on there. Go there. Here's a card that I created for her. And I've just uh, put some sequins inside. And last but not least is this Happy Mail package. I have done a clipboard and we were supposed to make handmade um, embellishments, a memory decks, and I have created all sorts of different uh, items for her here. I've got some charms that you can see sort of peeking through, and I have some homemade butterflies. I've got two packages of those, a little library pocket, and my memory decks. I've also made her another charm, and I've hung it there, and that is there. So I have to give her still one more thing, and that is I have to wrap up her gift. So, and for the purchased item, I am going to gift her a set of these La La Love stickers. 
I just love that crepe paper line. Love all crepe paper lines. Well, I used to until their designer went over to Simple Stories. I'm giving her a set of these gold words. I'm also gifting her a set of these sparkly stickers and a set of alphabet stickers. So she'll have lots of fun things to play with there, a good variety of items. So I'm just gonna wrap those up and add those to the top. Okay, so this is the last little gift I've wrapped up here and that will go in there as well. I'm gonna rearrange this actually and um, put all my shred in and get it all sent off. I'm gonna put this one actually on the bottom. So that one will go on the bottom. So, it's all about what the presentation is going to look like from um, the person that's opening it. I'm going to make sure that it looks cute, as cute as can be, so that she sees everything laid out exactly just so. There, and then we can put all of our shred fill in the spaces, some more white in. Sure everything is well packed and doesn't move around and it's very pretty to the eye when the recipient opens it. It's all different colors together. And then with some gold on top. And then the card can be situated there. I'm going to sprinkle in some hearts. And add some fun little polka dots and confetti. These little red bows as well. It's almost like making a sequin mix so there's all sorts of goodness when she opens the box. Got our pom pom and shaker bits. All kinds of goodness. There we go there. Okay, so that is the whole package ready to go. And I thank you so much for watching. Definitely, you're going to want to check out all the girls who are in the Secret Cupid Swap. We're all going to be posting on Fe February 14th. And I will make sure to link everybody in the video unboxing what I have received. Thank you so much. And I'll see you again next time.